Well, hello and welcome to this first exam question on invariant points. And it says um, find the equation of the line of invariant points under the transformation given by the matrix. Sorry, matrix M, which is minus one, two, minus one, two. Then now the matrix M, you notice that two times minus one plus two times minus one, or sorry, minus two times minus one, uh, will give us uh, zero. So the matrix M is, is a singular matrix, which means that with this transformation, all the points on the same plane will be on a line. All the points on the same plane after, trans after transformation will be on the same line here. So what we then have is if I then do that, if we got points x, y after transformation by this matrix M, yeah, will give us the points um, x prime, y prime there. So let's have a look. What we then have is that x prime will have the value of minus x minus y because minus x, sorry, minus one times x will give us minus x and minus one times y will give us minus y. So x prime will then be x prime is equal to minus x into x plus y, which is the same as saying minus x prime is equal to x plus y. Now this is important here. Right. Now, similarly, our y prime will have now have the value of 2x minus, sorry, 2x plus 2y. So this is 2x two, two plus 2y there. And after um, simplification, okay, you then have that 2, so that x prime is, is 2 into x plus y. Now, note here, is to x plus y here and the x plus y here as well. Which that means that uh, y prime is now minus 2 into x, sorry, y prime is equal to minus 2 x prime. And you can safely say that this is the same as y is equal to minus 2 x. Okay, so now I need to draw this graph of y is equal to minus 2x just to illustrate what I've been saying there. So this is my grid here, and this is my the line of y is equal to uh, y is equal to 2x minus 2x there. So now if I had a triangle given by the points minus 3, 2, 3, 2, and 5, 0. Now we shall now transform these points using the matrix M, and we end up with the point 3, 2, now becomes minus 1, 2 there. So, and this is what we got there. So, this point 1, 2 is on the line there. Similarly, the point 3, 2 will now transform to minus. 5, 10. So this point transforms to that and minus 5, 10 is there. Excuse the accuracy. And lastly, the point 5, 0 also transforms to minus 5, 10. Okay? So in effect, this 2, 3, 2 and 5, 0 we have the same common point there. And so all our points after transformation by this matrix M will appear on the invariant line. Now, I, I do hope all that made some sense and please, please subscribe. Thank you for watching and bye-bye now. Bye-bye.